All right, shout out to Madhu Sudan. He left this awesome comment asking how to export to Excel files using dynamic file names based on month. So for January, it would be my report one XLSX. For February, it would be my report two XLSX. For March, my report three XLSX. I guess you get the idea. I thought what better way to show this than through an example workflow. So let's jump in. Here's our setup in Nine. We have this basic workflow that reads a CSV file. We then convert the purchase date of that dummy file into date and time and group the revenues by product. This creates the report we want to export to Excel. Here at the top, we have the date and time widget node. If you click the small magnifier icon, you can set the date or just use today. Then we use string manipulation nodes to extract the month. We delete leading zeros from it and finally create the file name. Then we convert that file name into a variable of data type file path. We feed this into the Excel reader node. And then we write with this dynamic file name back to our local machine. And here we go. Just like that, we've got dynamic file names set up. Pretty cool, right? By the way, you can find the example workflow I have used here on the Nime Community Hub. The link is in the description. So that's it. A simple setup that saves you a lot of manual work and time when you set up monthly reports. And if you found this helpful and want to see more tips and trips like this, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.